Hey, hello guys, welcome along to another video um, and it's going to be something different with this video um, I'm not going to be showing any games or uh, Xbox games or whatever what I'm going to talk about is movies um, I would describe myself as a movie fan um, you know because I love watching movies and I, watch, I love watching different styles of movies I mean I love sci-fi um, but you know, I'll also watch other types of movies, um, whether it be something like Atonement or the Side of House Rules or you know or you know Inception or um Alien or Terminator or you know, so I like a, a wide range of movies. Um you know, and I always buy the Empire magazine, I bought that for the last three years or something. Um I'm a I love reading that magazine. And um you know, and I like watching all the awards that have gone on the Oscars and then the the um the BAFTAs and all the other ones, eh? So but then there's a lot a lot of movies, classic movies that I've never seen. And um I think I think personal, if you call yourself a fan you've you've kinda got to watch these classic movies. Because they're they're classic movies for a reason. So what I did is, I went onto the um, IMDB, and I use that site a lot, and I'm sure you're aware of it, it's Internet Movie Database, but IMDB, type it in, it'll come up right away in Google, um, and I go in there and I mark different films and TV shows, and I get all my information from there. So, and you're allowed to vote for for films, eh? So I've looked at the top list of movies of, of all time. And um, I've went down that list, and what I've did is I've every time I've I went start number one, I went down the list, and if there's been a film there that I've not seen, I've wrote it down. So I've got a list here of twenty films that I've never seen, and, and um, I've got them all set up on my computer to watch. So I, that's what I thought. I thought, I thought I'd go through the list, and um, and then once I've kind of watched them, come back and. I'll let you kind of what I think of these classic movies because they're deemed as classics. Right, so let's start with the first one here, right? It's The Good, The Bad and Ugly, 1966. It's a western, that's all I know of it. I think Clint Eastwood's in it, is he? I'm not sure. Um, luckily that one's on Netflix, so I'm gonna I'll be able to watch that through Netflix. Funny, because I've wrote 20 here and the only one that's on Netflix is this one. The rest of them are even on Netflix. Um, right, so that's all I know of it. And a lot of these movies I don't know nothing about. Which is always good, I think. I think if you've got, um, I like sitting down and not really knowing what the movie's about and sitting down and just watching it and just letting the story be told to me. Um, number two, Schindler's List. Right, I know, I know that's done in black and white, I know it's Steven Spielberg, and I know it's about the, um, was it a German officer who had saved a lot of Jews and all that kind of stuff? That's all I know of it, but yeah, I've never watched it yet, so Schindler's List. Uh, Seven Samurai, Japanese movie. I think in it's the um, what was it? The um, that was the first movie, and then there was a, an arm movie done. Oh, Magnificent Seven, is that right? The West End, and that was taken from this, I believe. Right, that's all I know. But I've got it, City of God. Know nothing about that. Seven with Brad Pitt and Morgan Freeman. Um, I think I've seen this. I saw some of it years and years and years ago, but I, I, I was either um, in amongst loads of people. When I watch movies, I like to watch just me in the, in the telly. And a lot of times I put my headphones on. Because um, I like to hear everything and I like to be solely focused. So I think when Seven was on, I must have had people around and, um, and I can never watch a movie like that. So, Seven. Um, Once Upon a Time in the West, 1968. Know nothing about that western, obviously, but Casablanca from 1942. I mean, I know um, the famous kind of scenes and that in there, but I don't know anything about that. Rear Window, from 1954. Alfred Hitchcock, I believe. That's all I know. Um, number nine is Leon, from 1994. Don't know anything about that, but number ten, Apocalypse Now. It's about Vietnam, I believe, but that's all. Oh, is it Martin Sheen that's in it? That's all I know about that. 
Uh, number 11 is North by Northwest. I know that again, an Alfred Hitchcock movie, that's all I know. Number 12, Spirited Away. Now that's the um, Ghibli, is that how you see it? The Ghibli Studios. Um, so it's that anime and it's that particular style. I mean, I've seen, um, well, I've seen bits of my neighbour, Tonto, Tontoro, Tonto, because my kid watched that. And the, um, one of his other ones, Ponyo. Um, so I know that kind of style, but Spirit of the Way is up there, so that's why it's on my list. Number 13 is Citizen Kane. You know, I started watching that's for 1942 or something, isn't it? It's, it's Austin Wales. I know nothing about the film. Um, I've started watching this movie today actually, but then I got interrupted with my kids and that, so I've watched the first, I don't know, 50 minutes of it. Um, it's kind of weird at the start, so I've no really, it's no thing with me yet, but it's a classic movie for a reason, so there's a reason why a lot of people have voted it. Uh, number 14, The Pianist. Again, I've only seen wee bits of this, I think it was on a night shift and somebody dropped it in, but I never. Couldn't get into it and I never watched it right and all that kind of stuff, but pianist. 15 is Vertigo. Hitchcock movie again, I believe. So I know. 16, Taxi Driver. Now, I've never seen Taxi Driver. Robert De Niro. That's all I know. I don't know if he's a taxi driver or he's not a traffic I don't know anything about it, uh, but I know he's in it. Number 17 is Wally. -E. Again, it's a Disney movie, but I've never seen it and it's high up there in the list. Um, so that's done. To Kill a Mockingbird. I don't know if I've ever seen this, or I've just seen bits of it. I know it's the, um, is it Gregory Peck? But he's in the, in the south and he, he's a, he's a, like a lawyer. And, um, is it like a black man or a black family's thinking for rape or something? So, then it obviously it's set in, I don't know if it's maybe set in the 60s or 50s or, um, number 19 is Early Confidential. A movie I've never ever seen. I know there's big actors in it. But I've never gone to see it. And number 20 is 2001 A Space Odyssey. And that might be a big sci fi movie buff and um, never seen 2001. <laughs> so there we go, 20 movies that I just started at number one. And like I said, wrote down films that I hadn't seen. All, obviously, all the ones I've seen, um, I've seen, but these ones I've never seen. So I'm going to watch them, I've got them all set up, I'm going to watch them and then come back and let you know because I think I'm a, I'm a film fan, I'm a film buff. So I'm going to let, let you know how I got on with, with these movies. Thanks for watching guys and catch you next time. Cheers.